and immediately we get two into the lower hub for the Red Alliance, but Blue Alliance also managed to get two more in, and two more in for the Red Alliance. Ooh, we had a couple of human player shots, and one lands in for the Red Alliance. We've got two more into the upper hub, thanks to Galactech for the Blue Alliance. And some additional both red and blue cargo, thanks to the digital goats and the quadrangles. And there's one into the lower hub for the Red Alliance, thanks to the O'Reilly Wild Box. And two into the upper hub, thanks to the digital goats. Digital Goats works to line up their shot for the Red Alliance. Ooh, and that's one more cargo into the upper hub. Another run into the upper hub thanks to the Quadrangles for the Blue Alliance. And one more into the lower hub for the Red Alliance thanks to the Wild Bots. We've got the Digital Goats lining up their shot. Meanwhile, the Quadrangles get two cargo into the upper hub for the Blue Alliance. We've got Galactic trying to line up their shot. One more in, thanks to the Wild Bots for the Red Alliance. Digital Goats is lining up for their climb for the Red Alliance. Galactech is doing the same for the Blue Alliance. That's one red robot in the air onto the mid rung and climbing onto the high rung. We got one blue robot climbing up onto that middle rung while their alliance partner, the Quadrangles, gets one more into the upper hub for cargo. And we've got a red alliance robot on the traversal. We got the digital goats. All right, we got two red robots in the air and one blue robot in the air. This is a close match. Let's see how these fours turn out. All right, let's see these scores. And the winner is the Red Alliance. With a final score of 63 to 42, looks like those extra hanger points really came in handy, keeping the digital goats in fifth place.